So, I've been ill, which is why it's been a while since my last update, but um, I finally got round to changing the code for the H-Bridge, and this is just to show you that it's working as such. First off, I realised that what I needed to do was have all of the inputs from the joypad uh, come in at once. Uh, which was a bit of a task, but not too much, but it means you can basically push any button, any combination of button on the joypad, uh, and it will be fed straight to the Arduino. I then had to write in uh, the control method for the H-bridge, which is there, but I can't be bothered to go through it. I shall uh, attach camera to the tripod and then I'll show you in action. It's not connected to the walker at the moment. I shall do that tomorrow. I shall be back in one moment. So here's the setup. We've got the Arduino, the joy pad, the dual H-bridge. One side of the H-bridge is connected to the multimeter just for ease uh, and then the other side is connected to the motor. Now, this side is connected to the multimeter, so if I push forwards on this, you can see the voltage slowly rises. And then if I pull back, we get the minus voltage. And then to show working with the motor, that's on this side, you push forward on here. And then back the other way. Now I did have an optocoupler in here, uh, where's it going, this one here, but in fact it was giving very odd readings, it would only ever go full on or full off uh, in either direction. Now I was told that some optocouplers just can't switch on and off fast enough, the, the light sensor. Uh, on one side just isn't quick enough to deal with PWM which may be the problem here I have no idea it's a bit peculiar I was also getting some problems because uh, I hadn't grounded the Arduino with the battery ground on this side but removing this and attaching that ground it actually seems to work fine it's just connected to a two cell at the moment um, there's a lovely smell of hot electronics <laughs> but as I say it, it does seem to be working I was going to post a video last night but there were so many issues which I just couldn't track down but as I say they all appear to have come from the optocoupler so I'll just remove that the truth is you know uh, at Mega 328 chip doesn't cost soddle so if I was to blow it because of the H-bridge acting funny we could just replace it anyway and not uh, worry about it too much but anyway I'll attach it to uh, the walker and then I'll do another video